the bus. Is it, there's a bus? That's the way the town's saving money, is that they're bringing the buses over here for a car wash. That's great. Make the kids wash it. They ride on it. <laughs> Welcome to Carpooling with Ben. You know, Rhode Island is a unique state. Beautiful state. Lovely. And I'm sure every state has their quirks, things, issues perhaps. But when you create an Instagram account about it, and that Instagram account has over 13,000 followers, and your average post gets hundreds, if not thousands of likes, you're onto something. Meet the man behind at Rhode Island Probs on Instagram and Twitter. And Twitter. Russ Truly. Russ. How you doing, Ben? Thank you for coming. Nice to be here. We made some specific arrangements for this one. Mm -hmm. uh, we passed no more than five Dunkin' Donuts. We tried. And at this point, my car needs to be clean, so we're going to get it washed over here at a car wash. Sounds good to me. All right, and we'll keep the interview going. Okay. Because uh, I believe in supporting the local economy. It's fine, Sam. I do too. What do you do? Like what? your full time gig? What What do you? Are you, are you uh, social media marketing. A lot of digital okay. marketing. Wow. Uh, website stuff, but mainly social media. Like two of a feather over here. Yeah. You know, that's uh, that's wonderful. There are a lot of cars in line for this a lot car of wash. Supporting the economy. That's good. So we'll we'll keep the interview going just okay. during this. So what what made you want to start? Start the probs? R.I. Probs. I mean, what, what kind of inspired it? So I actually didn't even start it. Oh, okay. Uh, my girlfriend started it. Uh, my girlfriend, Erin, who helps me run it today. Oh, all right. Um, shout out to Erin. Thank she, you so much, Shout out Aaron. to Erin. Um, she started it when she was in college. Okay. And it was called Rhode Island Girl Problems. And it was basically just problems that she kind of personally ran into. She was just running it for fun, kind of a side project for her. Sure. And it started to catch on. Yeah. And I didn't even know about it. We were dating at the time. I didn't know about it. <laughs> She was just doing it on her own. It is what it is. And one day, I think she turned on 92 Pro FM for me, and she got a shout-out, and she was like, that's my account. And I was like, oh, that's awesome. You know, at the time, I was in school, too. So, yeah. you know, I was marketing, business management, and I was just kind of offered... What school? Seton Hall. Okay. Seton Hall in New right. Jersey. Yep. Go Pirates. Um, so she was, you know, showing me the account, and I was like, well, that's something I could help you with. You know, I'm marketing, I'm business management. And I think at the time, we were at 2,000 followers on Twitter. Yeah. And, you know, we sat down. We came up with some strategies, scheduling our content yeah. with our demographics we wanted to try to target. And it just took off from there. And it's been something that's been so relatable to, I think, the entire state of Rhode Island and, and everybody, no matter their age, that it's uh, we gotta pay the lady. taken off. Hi. Hi, how are you? How Good. You we're, we're filming a web series while we're doing this, so here's the money. Oh, and you. we're just wash the car. It'd be great. great. Go <laughs> Barrington Field Hockey. Thank you so much. Um, this is going to be interesting. She's going to tell all these girls now that yeah. this is what's happening. So it's going to have a lot of uh, hey. So you were saying um, you were kind of putting together the strategy of how mm -hmm. you're going to grow the yeah. channel, and it's yeah. worked out. It's worked very well. Um, do you find there's any shortage of content like out there? Like, do you have a hard? It's not a shortage, but there's limitations. Okay. Because uh, you know we're we're very focused on Rhode Island, so if things are in Massachusetts or Boston. We kind of have to be careful of that because it's Rhode Island problems. The way I explain it, our account to people is we put a, a humorous spin on life and current events in Rhode Island. Sure. What are some of your favorite posts? Uh, some of my favorite. I think my favorite saying we've ever had is, it's not a small world, it's just a small state. Yeah. Because, you know, you're always bumping into people. And even, like, I've, I've had story people uh, submit stories to us on Twitter and Instagram of, uh, you know, they traveled across the world to Australia, to Greece, they traveled to Florida, to California, and they'll bump into someone from Rhode Island or they'll see a Rhode Island license plate. Sure. Uh, which happens to everybody. But it's, uh, I think that's my favorite saying, is it's not a small world, it's just a small state. Yeah. Or you go to Iceland, like I did, and, I, yeah. and you find the yeah, guy that was in... Yeah, and all of a sudden you're in that a was in, video. That, well, I found the kid who was in the video. <laughs> oh, did you? I found him. Uh, matter of fact, you can, you can find that right here. Just walking around here in Iceland, and whoa, it's Rhode Island! such a great place to come and visit and, and spend time here. Wait a second. This is the guy! He's the one in the, What is your name? Robert. It's Robert from Iceland! 
not in Rhode Island. Yeah. He's a local celebrity, even though he's not local. He, it, it's exactly it, yeah. you know, and he did a great job. His name is Robert. Uh, and uh, when I went there to visit on vacation, uh, it, it was interesting because, you know, this whole piece that was focused on Rhode Island, they know more about Rhode Island and Iceland than we know here in Rhode Island. <laughs> so, you know, it was, just, it was just one of those funny things that happened. Hi, how we doing? Hello, everybody's excited. That's it. So, um, That's funny. So, <laughs> so uh, what, 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 what's been your favorite posts so far? Favorite posts? Ah, oh, man. I, I really like the pyramid. The pyramid of, of intelligence. Like, you know, <laughs> and then right at the top, right at the pinnacle there, the ability to navigate 195. Yeah. That That's a uh, true I mean, true words never spoken. I, I was, I'm a born and raised car enthusiast, so yeah. the, all the driving... Uh, memes and issues that we have i love those yeah everything about 95 construction people not using their blinkers sure you know. never having enough dunkin donuts or no. dunkin donuts being closed you get in someone's not. car and there's 55 dunkin donuts cups in the back seat oh yeah no it's it's all there you yeah. know it's it's all of it you know our ability to order dunkin donuts i think is one of our greatest feats, oh we're pros. Know, just just to say you know just a medium regular and i mean yeah. and we know at this point that all dunkin donuts are not created equal no you have your go-to dunkin donuts spot and if, you, if you're forced to go somewhere else it's pretty much you know a wild card what you're gonna get oh yeah no it's it, it's it, it's a wild card what you're gonna get they don't know your order you don't know the kind of like how to stand in line <laughs> exactly but you don't you can't even just nod it's to a totally the usual world. right exactly yeah. have you have you been able to you know have advertisers reached out to you and said like hey we have love love what you're doing there. we have we, yeah. we, we've, we've done that we've I uh, worked with a few companies um, here and there. Our which biggest, is, which is, which is, you know, the, ultimately, it, it, yeah, it's a, it's a whole different spin on, yeah, you know, your girlfriend's girl problems. <laughs> it's it's grown a ton. I think yeah. the um, the biggest issue with that is, is like I said, we're, we're restricted to Rhode Island. Yeah. Uh, so a, a national company isn't going to use us per se. Yeah. But something like you know Newport Creamery or Dell's or you know, New York City. Warwick ice cream. You've Warwick been, ice cream. We've been yeah. talking all about the new Dell's flavor lemonade, which is which is huge. Everybody everybody has been going crazy over that. Have I you tried it? I haven't tried it. Oh, yet. you got to try it. I haven't it's, tried it's, it yet. It's fantastic. Yeah, and uh, they have the Moonstone vanilla, which is Moonstone just completely stripped down <laughs> in in its original form, which is which is fantastic. I'll try that it, one it, too. You gotta, you gotta, I gotta, want to make the uh, the Dell's lemonade uh, cabinet. Get a milkshake guy. Do you have people reach out to you and send you suggestions that you just kind of think like, eh, that wouldn't be that great? All the time. Yeah. Um, I mean, people are passionate about all different kinds of stuff. Yeah. We'll have people, especially now that elections are coming up, give us kind of political stuff. Oh, yeah. Um, which we try to stay away from because it is, the way we see it is it kind of divides people. Really? Political stuff on social media <laughs> just divides a bit. people? Just a little bit. I had no idea. Speaking of, of where things used to be, you know, obviously it's where the... Uh, where Benny's used to be. Mm -hmm. It's a big one. It's a sad one. R.I.P. That's a that's a tough one. You know, we're about to go into our first fall without Benny's yard bags. Uh, Unless you stash them away, we're smart enough. Well, you got a whole supply and yeah, you can sell them on. Probably somebody, a, some little you, kid out there you, is going to have a sell Benny's them, yard bag sale. Absolutely, you can sell them up on bag, uh, yeah. sell them up on the eBay there. <laughs> All right, we're done here. Good people at Barrington Field Hockey Team. Mm -hmm. Good luck yeah. to them. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Shout out to the parents. <laughs> uh, if people want to learn more about your channel, uh, it's very easy. It's not hard. You just no, go not. right. Where, where can they find you? We're on Twitter uh, yep. at R I Probs, R I P R O B Z. Yep. And uh, Instagram at Rhode Island Probs. I'm not going to spell out Rhode Island because everyone knows how to spell that. But sure. P R O B Z again. There's and it, and it, yeah, it's it, it's going well. It's, it's going, going real well. We got 100 and, over 125,000 followers on Twitter, and we're almost at 14,000 on Instagram. So creeping up on 150 total. Uh, Russ, uh, you know, uh, for, for being part of the show today uh, and, and being that you are a Rhode Island channel, I figured uh, Rhode Island, the only state where a guy who has nothing to do with CrossFit whatsoever mm -hmm. writes a book about uh, your mommy doing CrossFit. Excellent. Here is uh, your own written, oh. illustrated, and printed in Rhode Island edition of Because Your Mommy Does CrossFit. How about that? There you go. Some nighttime reading. Absolutely, it's a, it's it's a great read. I've, uh, I've I've read it a few times.